Hey there, I thought I'd do something different, uh, very movie oriented today, but uh, as usual, uh, but slightly different on the collector side. When uh, Blockbuster closed up my area, it was a bummer. Like I mentioned uh, yesterday, I picked up a lot of DVDs, uh, some of which, uh, Blu rays of which I showed yesterday, but I uh, also picked up some of these cool uh, art card things. I remember when you were running from Blockbuster, or some you still do, they have like full like, like movie cards, or maybe out back, so uh, I love the. Uh, the art on these things, so I uh, asked if I could have them. So he told me to pick up whatever I wanted, and that's what I did. So I'm going to show some now. I won't go through all of them, I don't think. It's a crap lot of them, but here goes. Uh, a lot of these movies, some of them I haven't even seen, but I just want the cards, so they're really cool looking. Beauty and the Beast, Estelle Warren, Beautiful Girl, I don't think I've seen that movie. Ba Battle of Los Angeles, Case 39. Fast and Furious. I love the next one, by the way. Friday the 13th, Killer Cut. I love the art on these things, man. These are awesome. Law Abiding Citizen. Casino Royale. Next one's cool. Alice in Wonderland, the Giant Jump one. 30 Days of Night. I love this film and love the card. And Batman Begins. Next is a favorite movie of mine and uh, for better has. That is uh, Coraline. I really, really love the movie Coraline. It's really cool. I'm a big Neil Gaiman fan, so it makes sense. Big Tim Burton fan. Uh, Legend of the Guardians. Black Swan, Black uh, Edition, Black Swan, White Edition. I love this next card, but I don't think I've actually seen the movie yet. So guys, tell me if it's any good. I might pick it up. Uh, 30 Days of Night, Dark Days. Crap looking out of that. Machete. Watchmen. Yes, I did like the movie, guys. Wally -E. made me cry. Underworld: Rise of the Lycans. The Uninvited. Orphan. It's a real big fan of the next series. But sad when Daddy died. Uh, Spartacus. Rest in peace, Andy Whitfield. Some are some good TV shows that I actually like. Weeds, and no, I did not just buy that because Mary Louise Park, it looks hot in it. I didn't buy them anyway, they're free. Hey. Uh, Tudors. Nick Tuck, final season. It's kind of a western -y type movie, had fun with Canadian one called uh, Gunless. The much maligned uh, Prom Night remake that uh, I didn't think was as bad as everybody said it was. Come on. Slash movie. Not Shakespeare, man. Let the Right One In. And I love the next one, by the way. A movie that I really, really like. That is Behind, behind the Mask. The Rise of Leslie Vernon. Great movie. So it's the next one, actually. Uh, Dead Snow. Great one there. Blood, The Last Vampire, the live-action version. The remake of Children of Corn. The next one is a movie that I consider very underrated. Don't hear a lot of people talking about this one online, but I really, really enjoyed watching this. It was a little depressing, but I liked it. Uh, the Children. Yeah, I should be reviewing that sometime. Uh, Saw 6. Remake of Last House on the Left. Rogue, which I showed you here on a DVD I bought actually. Marine 2, just an action thing, but you know, cool. The Wolfman, I enjoyed the movie. Sherlock Holmes, way better than I thought it was going to be. Still, Jamie Brett is my Sherlock Holmes, though I do like the new series. Fear and Loathing Las Vegas, I love that movie. 
very trippy. Kang's New York. These are actually really nice art cards when you think about it. If you have a blockbuster store that has some of these, find out if you can, you know, if you collect the stuff, it's really interesting to get. And I collect, I'm really glad I got these. I haven't looked at these in a while, but you know, it's nice to revisit them. The Girlfriend Experience is Steven Soderbergh. So, yeah, I'm there for that one. I'm a fan of Soderbergh's. A uh, different type of horror movie, actually. Uh, Mr. Brooks, uh, Kevin Kastner. I am a Kastner fan. Uh, Del Toro. Pan's Labyrinth. Beautiful card there. Be everything by Del Toro is beautiful. That's the way he shoots things. <laughs> I love seeing this movie theater. Uh, Prana, the new one, actually, the remake version. Not the 95 remake, but that one. X, The Last Stand, X-Men Origins, Wolverine, I'm a big fan of the X-Men movies, Wolverine was not good, actually it wasn't good at all, but still, uh, Pirates of the Caribbean, At World's End, I got another X-Men Origins, Wolverine, a different cover, I thought it was really cool looking, so you know, the movie might be good, but the cover is awesome, uh, Transformers, the remake of Clash of the Titans, the extremely fun. If you haven't seen it, you should go see it. A uh, Frozen uh, movie, but it got me a hatchet. And Jello. Wrong Side of Town. So, what's funny is that uh, this movie stars uh, Rob Van Dam, but uh, Dave Batista is the main uh, person shown on the cover. Apparently, Rob Van Dam was not happy about that. And I uh, love animation, so. Scooby Doo's all new All Star Life Olympics and the series and really cool looking art card. This is a cool art. I don't think I've seen a movie though. I do like Terry Kaiser. Uh, Mask Maker. You gotta check that out sometime. Uh, Lost Boys the Thirst. Lake Placid 3. Let me in. Last Exorcism, and yeah, I really did like that movie. Uh, Death Sentence, it's, you know, kind of like a Death Wish thing. Uh, the really cool Palace. The Hammer Film Resident. thing I see, and the, and the one I see it. Every once in a while I see this at uh, Walmart. Never know if she pick up or not. It's in 3D. Uh, Scar. The miscasted movie Predator and the other uh, art card that uh, with the Predator, like that. Uh, I had more fountain than I thought I was going to. Prince of Persia, shot in Morocco. Rampage, Open House. Hope not boring with these guys. Uh, Jonah Hex, not a very good movie. Nice card. SNMN Sandman? Okay. Just like the art in some of these things. Uh, 127 hours. Beautiful art, beautiful movie. Uh, Dark City. Dark Knight. Drag Me to Hell. Of course, the uh, Statham movie uh, Death Race, because if it's got cars in it, you gotta have Statham. Uh, face Off, The Collector, Here, next one's a movie that I've loaned out some, I haven't got it back yet, it's really fun though, I, I don't know, so just have fun with it. Uh, Cornered, Steve Gutenberg's on this one, that's different, about a guy killing people at a, uh, that are working at corner stores. Uh, Sharktopus, come on, you cannot pass that, I heard up. Um, Violent Kind, Something called Under the Mountain, just like the art. Vanishing on 7th Street. Stakeland. Troll Hunter. I like that actually, it's a fun movie. Uh, tortured. Some different ones too, like Solitary Man, 
Takers. Next one, like that. Uh, Tron, very cool. For Hello Rising with Mads Mikkelsen, who everybody knows now for uh, playing uh, the Hannibal Lecter in the new Hannibal series. And of course, he was a little chef right now. Casino Royale. Uh, the Trotsky Tourist, because look, Angelina Jolie, she's hot. Uh, Badass actors now. Liam Neeson in The Unknown. Sniper Reloaded. Tekken live action film. Something called Smokescreen. Splice. The next one is really nice, which is Tales from Earth Sea. Next one is a movie that I I implore you never to watch. It's horrible. Vampires suck. Next one's probably horrible too. I haven't seen it. Uh, Your Highness. Whatever. I need a tall dark stranger. Yogi Bear. Transparency. The Twelve. Agent Brody and Rhett. Warrior's Way. Zonad from Space, probably. I like the art on the next one. Wyvern. That's what I do on the next one. Vengeance has never looked so good. I concur. Uh, that is the Vanquisher. Yeah, I got distracted. Uh, Witchville. Next one is the worst James Bond movie that was ever made. Quantum of Solace. A Country for Old Men. Another version of the tortured one. Californication. I really related to the uh, character of the writer that David Company played. Big Bang Theory. 24. Faustar Galactica Season 1. Punisher Warzone, really good actually. Punisher is okay. Incredible one. Next home movie, I really had fun with that movie. Stargate Atlantis Season 4. My uh, better half's a real big fan of Stargate. Stargate Atlantis Season 3. Something called Parasomnia. Something I gotta catch up on. Psych 9. The Incredible Eden Lake. Chaperone, yeah. Twelve rounds. Three hundred. This next one's cool. Twenty-eight days later. Of course, I got the Red Riding trilogy here. Red Riding eighty-three. Red Riding eighty. Red Riding seventy-four. The next one just a really, really nice looking one is a Rip. Of course, uh, Weeds. Season four. Season 5, Season 3, Dexter Season 1, first season. Love Dexter, by the way. Hi, uh, Dexter Season 3, Nip Tuck the fourth season. I'm a really big fan of Nip Tuck. Uh, Nip Tuck the third season, Nip Tuck Season 5, Part 1. Got some great coverage on these things. And the complete second season of Nip Tuck. Mad Men Season 1, Mad Men Season 2, Mad Men Season 3, back. and that's all I'm going to be able to do for this time, so hopefully I'll do some more and I'll get some reviews in, and uh, thanks a lot for watching, and right now it's time to go out, and I'll probably get my tea there, so uh, thanks all, and I hope I didn't bore you too much with the uh, art card collection, talk to you later, bye.